Hey guys, welcome back to Harmony Hill Homestead. I gotta show you my mess out here. This is my normal garden spot. Um, it's all grown up this spring. I left the black plastic down on my rose right here. Um, usually I'll till up this middle thing and we'll plant in it. Uh, this is the seventh year I've been here and I'm letting my garden rest. So I brought in these tubs to fill up to grow a couple of things for us to have to eat this year um so we're not you know having to go to the grocery store to get our tomatoes and stuff so uh in addition to that once i get all of this done what we'll do is um i'll just mow all this down i'm not going to till it i'm going to mow all of it down and then i'm going to cover it with some more of this black plastic so the whole thing will be covered this year it's breathable um as you can see stuff does grow through it this has been down for a couple of years now um but yeah it's a mess but it's just gonna have to be um taken care of and uh so no big garden for this year guys because again it's the the year that my garden gets a jubilee <laughs> so uh um, it's going to rest for this whole year. I will not be planting in the ground again until spring of 2025. So, um, yeah. Now, I am going to take a couple of my, like, my pepper plants and things like that. And I'm probably going to put them in my flower beds and let them grow up with my flowers. But other than uh, having a big, huge garden... That's not where it is on the farm this year. I'll keep you updated on how it's going and how I'm going to do the um, drip irrigation on it and things like that. But in total, I have, I think, 21 of these big, huge feed tubs. I may end up getting maybe five more. I don't really know. I'm having an issue with cats um, pooping in them. So, yeah, that's not making me happy either. So I've got some issues to overcome as far as container gardening, the garden this year. And uh, so we'll just see how it goes and I'll keep you guys updated. Until later, be happy, be healthy, and be blessed.